empezamos a subir de nivel. Toda mi gente se mueve. La fiesta la llevo en mis genes. Yo soy la reina de los nenes. Mi música los tiene fuerte bailando y se baila así. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Just Lost Jessie here. It's good to see you. I'm happy to be back. So today's video is going to be a haul video. I got some clothing items from Zaful, Zaful, however you pronounce it, and I'm going to be showing you guys. I already looked at them, so you already know. Of course, this is going to be a try-on haul. I'm probably going to try to style them. So let's get started. Let's get jumping there. Let's dive in. Let's get right to the bottom of it. Let's come back to the top and then we're gonna go to the bottom. <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna start with is outerwear. So I got this coat from them and the coat is really nice quality. I've worn it already. It's getting really cold in New York these days, but whatever. Um, but anyway, so I love this coat. It has some blue stripes and some red stripes in there. And I don't know, I just like it because I really like the blazers, the Prince of Whale check blazers that have been making an appearance. And also this color looks really good with yellow, like... <laughs> anyway, but yeah, the Prince of Wales check blazers have been making an appearance everywhere. And I actually considered getting a blazer, but the thing is, I don't really wear blazers that often. Uh, with my life, there's not much blazer events, so I was like, a coat in this check I would probably get more use out of. And I'm so excited that I got it, it's really long, it's really nice. You guys are going to see how I style it or whatever. <sighs> Love this jacket. It just fits perfectly. The sleeves are not too short. It's very boxy, almost boyish fitting. It kind of gives a blazer look. I don't know. I love it. Okay, so sticking to outerwear. Another thing that I got, you guys are going to freak out when you see this. Like, hello. This. Are you dumb? Are you dumb? I am mad. I am mad. This is a velvet blazer. Now I just said that I don't wear blazers that often, I understand you. But like, if you see a velvet blazer, how you not gonna take that? Like, what are you talking about? You gonna take the velvet blazer, okay. Anyway, so this is it. I have worn this already. Um, one thing I will say is I thought the green was going to be a lot more like emeraldy. It's kind of coming up very bright, but it's, it's more of like a muted green. Which, in retrospect, is probably easier to style than like a bright emerald green but yeah this is lined the sleeves are long enough it kind of covers my bum it's not like too short it has pockets and it comes with a waist tie so you can tie it around your waist this is this blazer oh i love it it's really it's not very structured it's very you know it's not thin that's for sure and i love the fact that it's lined it's not thin but it's not like you know the blazers i'm used to where it's very structured but i still like the look of it the velvet feel, the arms are long enough. In fact, a bit longer, which never happens typically. Um, so yeah, I decided to go with all black. And of course, my sock boots. And yeah. This look obviously playing with the greens. The greens, the greens, the greens, the greens, greens, beans, potatoes, tomatoes. But yeah, I have this green sweater that I got. This added the blazer, so it's like texture as well is being played with the different textures don't judge me don't judge me because i got a velvet blazer don't judge me because it's a style it's a look it's a vibe <laughs> all right so next i'm gonna jump into the sweater i actually only got one sweater shocking and you can guess the color i got it because i love this color so much and i only have like a t-shirt this this color and i was like well when it's like winter time and i still want to wear this color because like yellow is my thing what am i gonna do and then i saw this on the side it's a yellow sweater it's like the same exact color it's really nice because it's a high low sweater of course i've worn this already i've actually worn it with that jacket and let me tell you sis it was a look it was a mother look guys can we just appreciate this cut like are you mad are you mad are you mad so this is a sweater it fits really really great really oversized which I love it's kind of high low as you guys can see a bit different I like pairing yellow and black as most people would yellow and leather I think that texture is perfect sweaters and leather in general but the contrast between the bright color and also I love adding gray with yellow I think that it looks Really, really good. So I added this trench. So this is if you're really trying to go crazy with yellow. You guys know I had these yellow pants. So I had to put the two together just to see how it looked. And I absolutely love it. 
with some nude shoes so it just looks like it's just this block of yellow shocker shocker i'm buying a t-shirt but yeah i got this t-shirt i haven't worn this one um but yeah i just need some t-shirts uh most of the time i'm very active at least my program is very active so I wear sweatpants and t-shirts, so I was like, let me get some t-shirts that are more fun than like the free t-shirts that I got when I was an undergrad. Hello. I just like it. And I was born in the 90s, because I'm a 90s chick, and you know what it is. Go born in the 90s, and I'm here to say it. Then I'm rapping like I'm just in the same anyway, because you don't know what I'm talking about if you ain't from the age. But if you are, then you know the pain. Now if you're gonna turn the book, let's go to school. I'm gonna take you down, and you're gonna learn to rule, and the rulers in the system, and the position of the Yo, that was virus. Virus. That wasn't too bad, you know. I got another t-shirt, this one has yet to be worn as you can see but <laughs> okay let me show you first this is it I don't know what the hell the words say I'm not gonna lie to you I can't make that out um, the cactus are printed on there with plastic and the words on the bottom are actually actually stitched in now some of y'all might be like why'd you get a black shirt with some cactus I saw this and I had to get this is so me I always call myself a cactus the cactus emoji is my favorite emoji everyone first of all has to have an awkward emoji that like when you don't know what to say you send that I feel like you have to so just go stop actually don't stop this video but after this video go into your phone pick an emoji that's gonna be your emoji the cactus is mine because I just feel like an awkward cactus plant sometimes I don't know what to do sometimes you just feel like a cactus no well I do anyway and so people know that, and so I was like, this is perfect. I have a t-shirt. With all my friends! <laughs> Here's another look. Very simple. Main reason why I got this t-shirt too, is so I could have like a graphic tee that I like, which I love cactuses, to go with some of my cropped denim. I've amassed a huge collection of cropped ankle culotte denim. Um, but yeah, I want to wear them these denim with tops that I like and potentially a blazer so this is my old faithful blazer that I love got it thrifting and I think it looks really good with this the dark colors on top and the blue and then the black uh, shoes yeah okay so the next thing that I got were actually pants the only pants that I got from the full these denim or jean pants they're actually culottes because you know I, or crop, cropped or capris whatever you want to call it I love these pants I freaking love these pants this was a gamble because like I said I have never ordered jeans from Zephyl so I wasn't sure how the fit was going to be but I love them it comes with this strap which I think this adds such a cool edge to it I think they fit perfectly there are these jeans from Madewell that I saw a lot of people in the summer had and of course I'm not going to spend the money on Madewell but I've been wanting a fit like that, meaning like it's tighter on the thigh and looser. And so I think these are the closest to that. I really love the wash of them. I've worn them with the yellow sweater that I showed you, like this. And yellow looks really good together. Um, the one thing is that the waist is a bit large on me. Like the hips and everything fit well, but the waist is just a bit big. So I actually like took it in because I, like I said, I've worn these already. So I took them in myself, still not the tightest on the waist, but I think I can get away with not having to wear a belt, which is what I wanted. But yeah, love these, love these so much. I absolutely love this look. This is something I would wear easy. Like this is something I would throw on a chunky knit. Love a good turtleneck, sleeveless, even better. This one's really long and these are the pants that I got. Oh, I love these pants so much. But yeah, these light wash culotte denim, and then to add that pop of color, I went with my floral velvet uh, Ego official shoes, or booties, and this is it. I just love, I love this little detail, the string detail that comes down from the pants. I think it just adds a cool kind of vibe, but yeah. This is another look I can easily throw on, you know. Love these jeans. Just grab the button down, the vintage Ann Taylor coat, and uh, my loafers. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Of course, a button up. I feel like everyone has a classic button up. Okay, so this next thing, it is not the most it went to appropriate, and I know that. <laughs> but I bought it anyway because uh, why not? I've been wanting one of these. Plus, I also like wearing white because it just makes you look tanner. And I feel like in the winter, when you're losing your summer tan, that's what you want. You want to look darker. So, at least I do. Anyway. 
Anyway, the point is, I got this bodysuit. Um, it's one of those bodysuits with the square top. Very retro, very 90. You know, I might. You know, I might. Anyway, so yeah. I got this. I love the color of it. It's very stark white. It's not cream. It's not giving me off white. It's not giving me eggshell. It's not giving me, you know, I like it's white. It's white, and I appreciate that. So yeah, and it comes with adjustable straps, and it fits well, and I like it. The only thing is, it does not have poppers at the bottom, which is annoying. So you might have to take off when you use the bathroom. I'm not really sure. I haven't worn it yet. We're gonna cross that bridge when we come to it. But uh, right now, we good. <laughs> But yeah, so I'm excited to wear this. So this look is kind of, you know, eclectic and all over the place, but that's kind of me sometimes. So uh, this cami top, basically I'm going to wear it with high-waisted stuff. Uh, I can't imagine it with low-waisted uh, jeans, but maybe, who knows? Maybe my black skinny jeans on a night out, but I basically got it so I could wear it with blue high-waisted then I'm a lot of my high-waisted culottes, a lot of my mom jeans, so that's what I've been doing. This one, you know, I love using scarves as a belt, so I did that. I have my glitter brown shoes, these snazzy orange tassel earrings that I took from my mom. <laughs> and then this, it's just all over the place, it really is, but I just wanted to throw everything in there and see what sticks. You can modify the look for yourself, but yeah. And this last thing has to be my favorite, unexpectedly favorite thing from, okay, maybe not my favorite thing from this haul, but it was unexpected that I really liked it. This was kind of got on a whim, because I was like, oh, this, are, this is kind of cute. Bruh, this top, this top right here though, when you see it on, you're gonna know what I'm talking about, but if everything's sitting nice, it's looking rad, rad, nice hunting. Trust me, trust me, I may not have much, but it look like I do, and I think it's I t it's real, real, real nice. And this is one size and it comes in so many different colors. Um, it fits really well. I have not worn it yet. The tag is still on. It says, I'm guessing there's a top at Brandy Melville like this because it says on the Bradley Mitchell, which is very weird. But anyway, it fits great. I love this top and I can't wait to style. I'll probably wear it on a night out, honestly, because it's winter. But in the summer, I would wear this with some high waisted mom jeans. Give again that 90s feel and that, and that. So I love this top. I think it fits perfectly. It's one size fits all. I'm not too sure how accurate that is, but I like the way it fits on me. Love the color. Um, so with this look, I kept it pretty simple. Whenever I wear this top, I wear it with something high-waisted. Usually high-waisted looser denim. So like my culotte denim that I hauled here today, all the other denim that I have, things like that. And I decided to go with my black boots and a black cardigan. Okay, I actually got two other things from this haul. They're not with me. My little brother has them, so I'm going to show you how they look on him. But uh, I got some sweatpants for him. They have a men's section, and of course I'm not a man. But I have wanted to try out the men's section in a lot of these Asian sites, especially for taller people. My brother is a bit taller, and he's not, you know, I don't know. I just want to see how the sizing is for the men's section. It's really good. Uh, the pants fit well, which does not happen often when he buys things from AliExpress. Like, most of the time, they're very, very tiny. In fact, these sweatpants that I'm wearing now, he bought from AliExpress, and they fit me like this. So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? A lot of times, the sizing mishaps, but the pants fit perfectly. And I got him this top um, that you guys can see him trying on, and the top fits perfectly as well. The arms were long enough. I was very shocked. Uh, but yeah, he really likes it, and there with him. So guys, that is the end of this haul. I hope that you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed washing it or whatever, and the styles that I came up with. Um, what was I gonna say? This hair, I have a tutorial on my channel of how I do it. It's kind of old, and I'm probably gonna wash it today. But um, yeah, I have a tutorial on how I do it. It's my twist and curl, so if you're interested in that, I will have that link down below. And, and all the links to everything that I bought, of course, will be down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I loved sharing this with you. You guys know I love fashion videos. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Oh, ciao. I almost fell.